What's good, DC Squad? It's your boy DC Smooth here, back with another video. And today, I'm about to be reacting to the end of DDG and Ruby Rose. DDG just posted this video, like, I think an hour ago. I think an hour ago, he posted this video. It's been a lot of interesting stuff going on with these two. But, you know, they're probably going to end up back together or something. You know how people is. Everybody in relationships these days, toxic, and all shit, so... Them niggas might get back together. But he want he wanna just make this video and saying the end of them. But shit, you never know. If you're in the channel, like, comment, and subscribe, turn on post notifications if you're new, if you haven't already, hit that bell. And let's get into this video. What's good YouTube? Welcome back to another video with your boy DDG. Um today's video is basically an update video, you know. Um I got a little bit of Chick-fil-A here. I might do a little bit of eating, a little big bang or whatever. But today is really just an update video and me just trying to, you know, just detach myself from a situation that I know isn't good for me or the other person, you know, and the other person being Ruby. It's always um, something. And I want y'all to know, them, despite what I tweet, despite what I say, like this is a person that I spent hours, days with. You know what I mean? Like, go to sleep, wake up. She stayed at my house for a long time. Like, you know what I mean? We're, we're like a real actual relationship. You know what I mean? So I'm not going to sit up here and act like, you know, I ain't love her or I didn't have feelings for her. Or we wasn't really dating, blah, blah, blah. This other shit. It's a lot of stuff that y'all don't see online that attracts me. You know what I mean? She's a different person online than offline, right? Yeah, he probably... She's a very nice girl. Very, very nice. That's what I probably... That's what I was thinking when he first started talking to her. Like, he probably... He know about her, like, her past and shit. So, he probably was just, he like, fuck that. He ignoring the rumors and shit because he know er everybody's going to come at him and say, oh, she a blue, blah, blah, all this other stuff. So, that's how you got to play it sometimes. But I don't know how he did it. It's hard to play your role. Like, not play your role, but it's hard to, like, not listen to no rumors, bro. Like, I just, I don't know how he did it. I ain't going to care. But... Just like myself, I'm not gonna sit here and point the finger. She's damaged. I'm damaged as well. And, you know, niggas tried. You know what I mean? I've, I've been trying the situation. I've been trying to be in the relationship. And I've been trying to make it work. But it's just like, me and her just bump heads way too much and it's way too many third parties involved. And it just created a very, 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 very toxic relationship. Now, I already realized that, right? But in my head, you know, I'm like, okay, cool. My last relationship before Ruby, and y'all know who I'm talking about. Y'all bring her up every time. <laughs> it wasn't no effort from her <laughs> side. You know what I mean? It wasn't like, it, it was it was night and day. You know what I mean? And that's the reason why it's been so on and off. Like, I don't that's like this I'll toxic be in shit. The same relationship like that shit, bro. I'll be, the Latino community I'll be is big enough to elect the next president. So and that power is already showing. Bro. Joe Biden, listen, listen to immigration bro. experts and activists. I don't need to be posted on those shade room teams. I don't want to be posted on those shade room teams. That is not what I do it for. It's not what I do it for. Um, It's just me. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm an emotional nigga. You know what I mean? That's just how I am. You know what I mean? It's, it's nothing that I can... I'm not finna sit here and beat myself up about it. You know what I mean? I know I tweeted. I know I said what I said, blah, blah, blah. This other shit is just cause I'm hurt. Niggas get hurt. You know what I mean? I found out some shit and I was like, Niggas damn, that's, get hurt, I've been hurt too, that's, okay. that's fucked up. You know what I mean? And you still hitting me like, like you didn't just do this. You know what I mean? And then you lied about it, you know? And that's just one thing that just, that just irks me is just lies. But that's not to say I haven't lied to her about stuff, you know? And I feel like me and her is just, we're two superstars, you know what I mean? And I feel like this is us being together, it's not going to work, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's not going to work with bump heads too much. I realize that. But again, Ruby showed so much effort in trying to make shit work that I would like, I would get real back in. But it'll also be very, very controlling and like I wouldn't like if I like a girl picture it'd be crazy like it's like little shit like that you know what I mean and we'd get into the most pettiest arguments and the most biggest art and it'd turn into something very very big and then social media get involved but like the tweeting and stuff that's like my last resort you know what I mean it's like what can I do I'm not finna put my hands on you I'm not finna do this and that so I gotta publicly 
I gotta publicly move on from it. You know what I mean? And that's why I'm really making this video because I'm trying to. I really just want to just 100 percent detach myself. Let her do her. I don't want to see her on a on a like. You know what I mean? I just I just want to detach myself and I just want to focus on myself, my music, and my career and, and further that's myself need to do, as a person. Uh, um, like bro, like and I, man, he. We gotta get out of that, man. Get our last shit, bro. Focus on yourself. Focus on your, your rap career and shit. Cause, nigga, girls, bro, girls come and go. And shit, so that's what I be doing. Just focusing on myself, nigga. They gonna come. Girls gonna come and go for sure. So if I was him, he ain't taking no L, nigga. I mean, you good. You just, you know, you gotta just detach yourself from, from some shit like that. Shit, it's not easy though, but shit, he he ain't get over it though. I'm pretty sure. For her that, and that, and she know that me and her not gonna work. You know what I mean? But it's just like when you really nigga in, and you and, and you make a nigga love you, and you make a nigga blah blah blah, and then you still do bullshit, and then I start doing bullshit back, and it's just like at that point the relationship is already over. So it's really Damn just. Near. Last night I was tweeting, people seen it, blah blah blah. I let my emotions get the best of me. I'm not gonna sit here and act like I didn't, you know what I mean? But I'm also not gonna act like I don't love the girl. So this video is not to bash her. I know I said some shit, I'm not gonna spare her or some bullshit like that. That was really just me just trying to scare her and shit like that. But I wasn't gonna come on here and, and, and be no asshole and be no bully because she's a very, 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 very nice girl. She's just damaged as, you know, as, as well as yeah, many girls. Is. You know, especially in bone. this in this industry, it's like I didn't. I already knew what type of girl she was before I got with her. I knew her past. I knew all this other shit, but I let it slide. You know what I mean? I let it go past. I'm like that's before me, blah blah. blah. But some of the stuff also carried on into our relationship, and it fucked our relationship up. So Ruby, if you're watching this, you know I still got love for you, but I just had to. I had to. I had to say that. I had to say that because, well, before I start tweeting, like, if I, if I would tell her, if I would get mad or whatever like that, she would think it's a joke because you know why? We get back together every single time. So I'm like, okay, I can't keep letting this girl reel me back in. And in my last relationship, my last relationship, the one that y'all love to talk about so much, I didn't feel nowhere near as much effort into a relationship. Yeah, here we go at the ad. Y'all be getting mad when I put ads to make our voices heard. <clears throat> as this one. You know what I mean? Like my ex before Ruby didn't show no effort. You know what I mean? And I would Can't like I'm it. talking about so I already know how I can. was in that relationship. <laughs> I used to do crazy in love ass shit, but I would get no type of love in return you know what i mean so it's like me getting this well, finally being with a girl that's really going every type of case feel some type of way if i leave or is going to try to fight for me to stay Ooh, sorry, yo. it's just it's just something that makes me feel better you know what i mean i'm like damn i gotta stay with this girl and i gotta see where this go you know what i mean but in reality the relationship is just too toxic we argue we was arguing literally every single day um the situation that happened last night, I found out some shit, blah, 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 but she was also acting like it was nothing and she lied about it. Like, it's just little shit like that, bro. Like, I told yeah, her, I'm like, bro, you did. can do you. You can go fuck with any nigga that you want to fuck with, blah, blah, blah. I go fuck with any girl I want to fuck with. And that's cool. We can be cool. We can be friends later on in the future once we get over each other. You know what I mean? But it's just like, I don't know. It's something about the effort. Something about the effort that just kept me going. And a lot of y'all don't even know her like that. You know what I mean? Y'all just see what y'all see online, but she's really a nice girl. And it's like, I can't even sit on here and bash her. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to make no video bashing her. This whole point of this video is just for me to detach myself completely. I am 100% single. If you see me with a girl, you see her with a nigga, that's her business. It's my business. You know what I mean? That that's her business. And wherever I'm fucking with is my business. You know what I mean? And we're just gonna leave it at that. 
I don't want to hear no more DDG and Ruby Ball, blah, 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 all this other shit. You know what I mean? Just leave it alone. Yeah, you know, niggas on the relationship is doing too much, bro. Niggas is moving oh, on. Oh, niggas busy. Um, niggas don't know shit. Nah, me saying that, I don't air out no information. G posts message screenshots. I would never stoop that low. I would never show you messages or how she talked to me or anything like that. I would never go in depth and detail about personal situations that nobody else should know about. Like, and the shit that she said, the shit that she tweeted about. I could have came back and I could have said a million more things. But with that being said, um, Moonwalking in Calabasas is the number one added song on radio. Clap it up. It's the number one song added on radio and really radio. Number one, number one, number one. On Spotify is number two on Rap Caviar, the biggest playlist. Um, I didn't even know what rap all three of the biggest playlists. Cut. I still got my face on one of the playlists on Spotify. I'm the face of it. Um, the song is going so crazy. I know y'all want new music. I already know y'all want. We went from one million monthly listeners on Spotify. Never ever listened to my music before. Talking about his music, but please. That was the end of the video. How y'all comment below? How y'all feel about the Data G and Rubio situation? You think they should stay together, or y'all think they should just? break up i think they should break up and go cap because he just i think once he his see it's hard to say like to focus on a rap career and shit because this nigga already be doing that shit but it's like i don't know if ruby mm, i don't know maybe she wasn't the right one for him i don't know i can't really speak on it because i only see shit if, from the internet like he said but um but yeah <clears throat> comment below how y'all feel about this video but if you're new to the channel, like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on post notifications if you're new, if you haven't already. I really hope y'all enjoyed the video. I'm hurry up and upload this because he just uploaded this um, a couple hours ago. Probably be uploaded probably the next day. So, I'm hurry up and edit this video. But um, remember, y'all, stay smooth. Don't move. Head ass boy. And I'm going to catch y'all in the next video.